So, um, this is Kaido Hanyo, also known as on DeviantArt Piercing Light. I was caught or uh, tagged in a cosplay tag by Eureka slash fucking maniac slash all around crazy little person who wants to beat me up. But I know you won't, will you? Okay, so the rules are I'm supposed to dress up, put on, or make up my for my newest cosplay. Well, my latest one I've done is Zero Kiryu. Right now, the outfit's a little furry because, well, my mother loves cats, and we got white ones. And a day class uniform isn't really the best thing to be wearing white cats with, so I just chose a white shirt and used the wig. The wig's a little bit out of styling because I was kind of fooling around in a uh, big city trying to beat Dante from Devil May Cry. Okay. Questions. Okay, I've introduced myself. Uh, I started cosplaying... I'd say about grade 10. The reason that I started was <laughs> because of my girlfriend. I used to be dating Rochelle, I guess you'd call it, you know her as Banyan from the Banana Cats. Um, uh, the first cosplay I ended up doing, which I had to actually miss the con that day, and the costumes in my closet over there, I should really fix it up, um, was Shauron from Subasa. The, just the normal green outfit. I made a couple of other ones from his, mainly, if you've seen the, uh, filler anime, the last episode, the white, what I would call monk's robe, and I'm going to be making the last few chapters with uh, Silo from also from DeviantArt. Um, how long have I been cosplaying? Just about, this would be the second year. I've got a lot for <laughs> just two years. Um, how many cosplays have I done? Well, let's see. Um, two versions of Shaoran. I've done Zero. I've done Mori from the Host Club. I have a wig on the way so I can do Tamaki from the Host Club. Um, who else have I done? Um, work, I'm also currently working on Soul from Soul Eater, but I have, I only have the jacket and Death the Kid as well, because again, I only have made the, uh, jacket and the pants, well, I already had for both of them. Yeah, I own red pants, don't give it a second thought. Um, how do you get to your costume? Or, how do you get your costumes? Well, <laughs> I have to make them all. If I can get the simplest parts, I'll try to buy something and alter it. Like, Soul Eater, again, is getting a normal jacket, altering it, maybe fixing up all the colors. Um, the pants you can get yourselves, and the shoes, again, it's just altering. I alter the pair of canvas, or converse I had. Um, oh, screen went blank. Um, okay, what is your first cosplay? Why did you choose it, and how do you feel about it? Well, again, it was Shaoran from Subasa. I chose it because my uh, Banyan was doing uh, Sakura, so kind of the uh, Shaoran loves Sakura, boyfriend, girlfriend, so yeah, you can see why I chose it. <laughs> um, oh, sorry, um, message is out my ass right now. <laughs> I'm going to say ass on YouTube. Meh, I said it anyway. Um, I really like Shaoran. I've ironically loved him since I started watching uh, Gun Captors. Um, so I plan to fix him up and get him back out there, hopefully either uh, KCON coming up or if there's any cons before that I am definitely going to work my ass off to finish Shaoran so I can bring him, Soul Eater, and maybe Death the Kid out, if not Zero will come out. Um, what is your favorite cosplay and why? Um, I really like right now Dante and Soul because, well, they're just arrogant bastards and it's fun to play. Um, Dante is just so crazy. I love playing the games, the tricksters, the styles you get to do. Making the guns, that is fun. I've made the Bloody Rose for Zero. It's over there somewhere. Um, and that was just really, really fun. It was easy, but it was really, really fun to do. Um, what's my favorite thing about cosplaying is, I guess, being able to dress up, have fun have people recognize you as the character you're playing. Like, oh my god, it's Mori! I... You won't believe how many fangirls you get if you're a boy and you can pull off an Orin Host Club member. Holy crap, I was scared for my life. The fangirls were... Like, there was one, literally, at KCON, it happened in the end of January. 
There was one that hugged me as soon I got there first thing in the morning as Maury. She hugged me in the morning, swear to God, before I left. She was like stalking me. I got like 20 more hugs from her and it was like 10 o'clock at night. I was <laughs> kind of creeped out. So, yeah. Um, do I have a cosplay pet peeve? Um, uh, I'm trying to really think about this here. I guess it would be. Do I even have one that, again, would be the first question? I think I do. Um, I guess people who really don't put any work into it and think they're hot shit. I don't know if I can say shit on here either, but I'm doing it anyway. Um, I guess that's it. Oh, and people who just do it so they can... Not for the reason of cosplaying, not to just have the fun, not to show you can make these. Just for the people who are like, Oh, I do it because I have to, or I do it because, like... If, I've had people think you have to be emo to cosplay, and... Yeah, you don't. You just have to <laughs> know what you're doing. Either learn how to use eBay or learn how to use a sewing machine. Or hope your stores carry very, very specific items. Okay. Uh, tell me about my most recent recent cosplay. Well, the most recent finished one, of course, is Zero, uh, Zero right now. So that's why I'm wearing the wig. Uh, Zero was really fun to do because uh, I started getting into reading The Vampire Night and I really got into the story and then um, ah, the thing was, uh, God, how does this all go back to Banyan? Um, we ended up breaking up, and when we got back, the day we got back together was a Halloween dance. I didn't have any of my cosplays really fixed up or finished, so I borrowed, uh, Hyper Dude 5's, uh, Idol, or the night class uniform, and I wore that, and I just really loved the uniform, so I decided to make zero and use the uh, day class version because well I like black more than white even though well the, the two contrast together it's just, it's a, it's a nice combination so and I also chose them so I could try making a gun the gun I used was an actual working model like not not I'm not using like 50 caliber shells here like that kind of crap but uh yeah it's all I've got it up to the uh, safety spec so it has been brought in and it is legal and cons and just have to uh, piece tag it now. Speaking of tagging, I'm gonna tag, hmm, let's see, Umika, Yufs, Silo, and, hmm, who else can I tag? Hmm, ah, Mr. Pip, you know who you are. Ah, Free Hugs from Ratio, that's your DeviantArt name. Your tag, man. Do it. Do it now. Or be square like the button I'm about to press.